Hello everybody, this is a short update on what's going on in my life over here in the Philippines. Uh, as you can see, a lot of green around me and the good thing is that's also around the house. We started the house build uh, roughly four months ago and it's getting very close it's getting very close the out inside is mostly rendered the concrete walls the outside the roof is on uh, of course no water no electricity yet and uh, What's also going on is uh, inside is nothing yet finished, so no furniture, no nothing. Uh, you see the other one in the back is building around, I don't know, maybe two, two and a half years. Uh, but of course he has probably not the same resources as we have here so can't blame him but he did build big whereas we don't want it to be that big as there are only few people here so we don't need that much uh, giant space and we can use some garden uh, the place up here is very beautiful it's away from the center of the city, town, whatever you call it. You can hear the only sound you hear is now the music from the workers on the shop. There's not much cock, uh, cockerels crying, chickens, dogs, there are a few here, but they're not barking. Also no uh, no karaoke is running right now, so we will have to see how it looks later on. And yeah, here is another sample of what one is doing with his parcel. Growing banana trees and uh, or growing bananas like that and other fruits and vegetables. So he is more into farming. Here is another one building his house we will see how big it will be but he has a complete different structure as our house is based on concrete pillars and the concrete skeleton he went for the steel morning guys how much time okay okay and uh, yeah, so that's different styles you can build here. Uh, you may remember in the beginning when I came here, when I made my first video, I had big dreams, I had big ideas what I wanted to do and everything. And now after six months in the Philippines, of course you have to make compromises because nothing is the way you want it to be or to it goes the way exactly how you want it to uh, on my side i think i was lucky i had an engineer who is or a constructor where he is coming now uh, now we can continue uh, I just was interrupted with the uh, engineer, the general contractor, and uh, we did discuss some cha or not changes, some further instruction where I want what in the house, like a range hood on which side the exit has to be, and all things like that. Small stuff which belongs to 
when you when you are building a house and uh, this is one reason why I decided to build a house or start building a house when I'm here and not buy a house somebody else builds to not my ideas or my uh, instruction or what I want in a house. Uh, that's what I would suggest to everybody if somebody wants to build a house here in the Philippines I'll be on site have it checked all the time or have a person to build it or over make oversight whatever you want it who you trust 100% and who you know will follow your ideas, your plan. Uh, it won't be probably to 100% but to 95% so that when the house is finished you're still happy with it and you know what's in the walls, what's in the floor what concrete mix they are using and all small stuff like that which can give you a headache later on uh, because you don't see it when the wall is leaking when the water comes in uh, when you have a typhoon or anything else which can press the water in the separations or the, the it's not really a separation it's just a two-stage uh, pouring process for the concrete the rest you have the, the ground floor and then you wait let it rest and then you pour the second floor and there in between it can give kind of separation if you if you don't handle that right the the concrete pouring is normally less the problem the more problem is mostly uh, the hollow blocks which between if they are not good if the work is not done not done good uh, they can see uh, leak water you can see here is a hollow block wall I don't know how old it is but you see up there the iron uh, you can see it so it's a cheap build it's not anything which holds or is meant to be held for a long time so the concrete mix they are using here it's not a standard European one, two, three. It's more like a one, three, five or something like that. Hello, bro. Hello, ma'am. But she doesn't have really the money to to build something big. But who cares? Living up here, living up here in, in the green vegetation, as you see here around me. It's nothing to do with, with how, should I say, how much money you have. Of course, if you have more money, you build something bigger or better suited to your liking. But that's no reason why to be envious for somebody who has a bigger house if you have a place like that you have the peace you have the silence you have the nature which nobody can can give you with money and uh, we are just let's say roughly one hour from Manila from Quezon City away so it's easy it's we have there fast doesn't make another thing and here is another sample what one can do however he has uh, 
two lots maybe even four i'm not sure i have to count it it was about two lots yes here are in the guards some more buildings it seems that more and more are building here in the area <laughs> may get crowded someday yeah. the typical aspen uh, philippine dog race but it, that's life it's still it's compared to the place we are now in down in the town it's still quiet it's not that loud no traffic and uh, yeah it's peace and that's what I like that's what I wanted and uh, that's why I accept um, also some changes in plan some variation deviations from the idea you have and now we come up to another new project they have here just very close to our house it's a small resort with a swimming pool so when it finish can I join here enjoy here for a, a swim don't need to, don't need to build your own swimming pool and as you can see still nature around and silence and that is all what you need to relax to enjoy you're not too far away from all what's happening but you're still far enough away from all the noise what's going on and i hope it will stay for a few years more <laughs>